Ms. Katrina G says, trust the process. Work your way through it. You got this. You're winning all year long. Yes, you're in control. So go ahead and trust the process. And it comes from Ms. Katrina G. So if you have love, remember, love conquers all. Love conquers all. It's everything. The total situation. You're going to win. Press your way through. You got this. Yes, because God is love. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Ms. Katrina G, and I'm back with another video. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel where I am Ms. Katrina G, and we are the Love Jones family. So those of you who are newly subscribed on this side of YouTube, welcome to the family. Welcome to this side of YouTube where there's nothing but fun, positivity, and good vibes. If, not, if you have not already subscribed, Go ahead and subscribe to your girl's YouTube channel. While you're at it, hit that post notification bell. Yes, make sure the bell says all. Hit that post notification bell so that you don't miss none of the content coming your way on this side of YouTube. Also go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Let your girl Miss Katrina G, as well as the Love Jones family know that you enjoyed this video. Comment down below also because we do post notification shout outs each and every single day. And lastly, do not forget to share 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 this video with anyone with everyone let them know what your girl miss katrina g and the love jones family are doing on this side of youtube guys i am back i am back and i am back with another mukbang video with a twist I think I slipped in a quick little clip of, uh, yeah, an unpleasant debate from the last couple days that we had. Well, a couple days ago, rather. Anyways, anyways, we're going to talk, yes, about that and uh, what we need to do to get back with God as a nation, as a people, as a human race, because it's only one race and it's called the human race, for one. Anyways, I got some good old, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? corned beef on the menu. Some good old corned beef. And I got some cheese fries. So we're gonna have grace. We're gonna see what's on the menu. And we're gonna get into this video. Heavenly Father, we thank you right now for this meal. We ask that you bless this meal. Bless those Lord who do not have a meal. We ask that you continue to keep their bellies full, Heavenly Father. Lord, we ask that you bless this world, bless the land and country. Lord, touch the mind of our president and his staff, Lord. We ask that you continue to unite America as you see fit. We ask that you rebuke the devil right now, Lord. I pray for all those who are in need. A special prayer for Stacey Wilson, also for Tolly Bell, as well as for Cheryl Kennedy, Lord, and all those in the Love Jones family who continue to be faithful, Lord, to you. We ask that you bless their households, bless my family, bless the world as a whole. In Jesus' name, amen. Prayer is always in order. Yes, you pray for the meal. I know it's a mukbang channel, but it's a platform, so... Your girl gonna pray for everybody, the situation, because the Lord is working. So this is my Black Lives Matter cup. I have on my Black Lives Matter earrings, representing for the culture. And your girl got on my plaid dress. It's like a t. It's like a. It's like a plaid uh, flannel shirt dress. If you get what I'm saying, it flows. It's super cute. It's super cute. Let me see if I can stand up. It flows, it flows, it's so cute. I love it. That's my look of the day with my choker. And my bracelet that match. And my, you know, phone watch. Smart watch, whatever it is. But anyways, I got some double meat, y'all. Look at that. Ooh, ooh. Double, double meat. Let me get this out. Get this foil out the way. We gotta get a thumbnail. We gonna get a thumbnail. What are you guys doing first and foremost? Happy Friday. Praying everyone is having a blessed and wonderful Friday. The weeks are going by so fast. But God is so good. So, oh, messing up stuff, y'all. Taking the food away. Put that right there. Let's get a thumbnail.
All right, y'all know I'm over the top. So I have my ice. They gave me a Pepsi with the meal, but you know I'm gonna drink mine. Sweet sparkling water, my soda water. <laughs> it's actually gonna taste like soda. And this is the black raspberry flavor. Black raspberry. So, yes, it is Friday. Friday. We had Fruitful Friday last week. Let's go with mm, Faithful Friday. <laughs> faithful Friday, because God is always faithful. Cheese fries. Mm, let me see. I think this place here is called Maxine's. Mm-hmm. Mm. I took the ketchup off my, my little studio desk table. Mm -hmm. So I got some sweet baby rays though. So we're gonna eat some sweet baby rays. What do you guys have planned for the weekend? Long awaited weekend. I have no plans. Same old, same old. Just thankful to see another weekend. Because mm, mm, mm. they coming and going, y'all. Mm. Yes, I dip my cheese fries in barbecue. <laughs> so good. So, let's do a quick reaction on them. What we saw the other day, y'all. Well, y'all probably don't want to talk about it. Hot mess. Hot mess. I don't like rye bread. So, this is sourdough. I have Thousand Island dressing, Swiss cheese. I think a little light mayo, maybe, on here. I don't do the Reuben, y'all. I don't care for the sauerkraut. But, mm, this is my first time trying this with Thousand Island dressing on it. Pretty good. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry for the sister hungry. Mm -hmm. This is really good. Mm -hmm. Got extra meat. I think it was like three dollars extra for extra meat. Three dollars. Mm -hmm. I gotta make, I just dip this in there. I gotta make me another corned beef, y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Anyways, about the other couple nights ago. Couple nights ago. hot mess you know I think it's the saddest part is we come to a time where the morality the morals and standards of life any life human life is completely being tested here in America, over 401 years, there has been an oppression of Blacks, African Americans. My ancestors, some of your ancestors, 
And the thing is, you know, you hear people say, let it go, let it go. How can you let something go? But every time you turn, it's staring you right in the face. It's like adding insult to injury. It's adding insult to injury. There's still racism now. <laughs> yes, there was slavery. Yes, slaves were free, but there was still bondage. Terrible bondage. Don't forget about the civil rights days. Now we're dealing with police brutality days, which we dealt with back then. But there's so many people who do not agree with it. But there's still a group of fools. <laughs> I call them fools. The Bible calls them fools. <clears throat> who want to continue to keep it going. But it's not going to happen. God has the final say. But anyway. Mm. This is good, y'all. A little messy, but it's good. When you have the leader of all the free world, but really all countries acting like that. And I and I and I will say this, y'all. Biden handled it very well. Shut up is the least he could have said. Because y'all who know, Joe Biden know he cuss. <laughs> and uh, you pee in that position. Only God knows what could have really, really happened. You know, you want to have respect for all leaders. I respect all leaders. But it's hard to respect someone who continuously push out division. Bullying. I am so not a fan of bullying. Mm -mm. Let's learn what goes around comes around. What goes around will always come back to you. No matter what you think. It's going to circle right back to you. Twofold. It's going to come back even harder than the way we dish things out. So, it's so important to sow good seeds. And you know, a lot of times it seems like the devil's winning. How is this person getting away with this or getting away with that? Prospering in this, prospering in that. Nope. Your time is coming. That is the devil's reward. Those who do evil on this earth, that is their reward. They're reaping their reward. Mm -hmm. But when you can sleep at night with a peace of mind, which I think he did not, he probably was tweeting all night. All night tweeting. <laughs> Wake up with a peace of mind, knowing that you did something, you said a positive word to someone else, no matter what color they are. Or you treated someone fairly, although they may have not treated you fairly. Or you thought about the needs of, of the poor or, or another. Don't, don't worry, your reward is coming. But when we do things to try to get recognition and we bullying people, ain't nothing coming to that. Nothing good will come to people like that. Anyway, my favorite part was when the moderator told him, denounce white supremacy. Go ahead and denounce it. Why not? <laughs> what do you want me to say? <laughs> Guys, in order for you to keep your sanity, you got to see the best in every situation. Although that situation is hard. And then, when Chris was, when Chris was watching it, and we sit up, we said, well, let us hear it. Let's hear it. Go ahead and say that. Say it. 
Not at all, y'all. <laughs> Not at all. What do you want me to say? How does how do you say it? You know what he's telling you to say. Denounce them. Stand by. Stand down and stand by. Okay. So. You can never talk sense to a fool. Hear me again. You can never talk even common sense to a fool. A fool is going to always be a fool. It's going to always be a fool. So, it was, a, it was a showdown. It was a clown. It was a circus. It was a circus. And although you say, I want to turn it off, I'm going to keep watching. Because I, I like to know what's going on. And a lot of us who already, who watched it, some of us didn't. You didn't miss nothing. A lot of us who watch it, we already know what's going on. We just stay in tune. And we have to brace ourselves because you already expect certain things. It's so sad when you have an expectation of someone, good or bad. But when it's a bad expectation of someone, oh, I already know they're going to do this or say that. That's never good. Your reputation is so much. It's so important. It's everything. Although people don't see it that way. That's what it is. Your reputation matters. And you get up there and act a fool in front of the whole world. Not just your country. The whole world. Well, no. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's something different, y'all. So. Anyway, it was a hot mess. I said this to say, don't forget to register to vote. I believe it's until October 4th or October 5th. I'll look into it that we have until we are asked to vote. Red, Lord, forgive me. To register to vote. There's a deadline to register to vote. Please beat the deadline. Please beat the deadline. Get out there, get registered, tell a friend, tell a family member. Everybody need to vote. This is the the most important election of our time. People ain't going back. I'm sorry, I ain't going back to 50, never been there. Don't wanna revisit it. So, it's not gonna happen. There's more for you than there is against you. There is more for you than there is against you. So, it's so important to continue to keep the faith. First and foremost, trust in the Lord. And although there's people who don't believe in voting, my vote don't count, that's your opinion. That's your opinion. Anything you do in the name of the Lord counts. Where's, excuse me, where's your faith? Anything that we do in the name of the Lord, it counts. Because only what we do for Christ will last. What we do for this world, it won't last. But what we do for Christ will always last. So, my reaction was, it was a hot mess. I will be waiting for the next one. I'm waiting on my girl, Kamala. I'm waiting on Kamala. It's nothing like a sister, an educated sister with a gift of gab and a backbone. You know, they, they make it, oh, she's angry. They're always angry. First off, <laughs> we're bold. I'm a sister. I'm bold. I don't mind telling you what's what. I don't mind putting you in your place. I know how to get in my own place and stay in my own lane. So, and to be honest, all the stuff, I, I can't cuss on this platform. All the stuff as black, black women have dealt with, especially black mothers, single moms have dealt with here, they have the right to be angry. Am I now? Although, I don't see it. I have a right to be angry. Look at all the stuff that us black women go through. With jobs, with, um, in the household, dealing with what's going on with our black men. We have the right. So anyways, yes, it was crazy. It was a hot, hot mess. And, um, yeah. Still, he didn't say it. I'm gonna see if he said it in the next of the debate. But don't forget to register to vote. Watch and pray and stay woke in Toy Bell's voice. Stay woke. 
stay up to date, know what's going on, make sure you continue to keep your social distancing. I know it may seem like things are back in order, all is well, mm -mm. don't fall for the hype. Definitely not for that one. Cause he'll tell you anything. He ain't wearing one, you really wanna wear one. If he's not wearing doing anything, you wanna do the opposite. So, of course, T-Girl got a couple of quotes. This one says, this first one says, when we work together in love and unity, we can expect heaven's help. When we work together in love and in unity, then we can expect heaven's help. But we cannot be divided. When we are divided, there's other people watching, just like in a family. When a, a father or a mother tear down their own children that they gave birth to, and there's outsiders watching, it's so easy for the predator to come on in and humiliate that child the same way that they got it from home. So when we are divided here at home amongst one another, don't you think everyone else is watching? They're watching. They are watching. So we need the Lord back in America. We need the Lord in the schools. We need the Lord in our households, marriages, relationships, everything. So every make every effort to step oops, to keep the unity of the spirit through the bond of peace. Make every effort. It starts with you. It starts with me. I must make the effort to keep the unity with the peace. And we all know that peace surpasses all understanding. So what we dealt with a couple of days ago, the peace, <laughs> it wasn't nothing but God's peace and stillness that kept you from jumping through that spring. If you know what I mean. I'm going to keep it 100. And my girl XX Brilliant V's, um, her voice, her saying, I'm going to keep it 1,000 on this side of YouTube on this side of YouTube. So I'm human. And before anything, before you are a Christian, before you are whatever you are, whatever title you may hold or carry, you are a woman. You are a man. You are. You're not too holy that you don't understand, that you don't feel pain, that you don't have pressure, that you don't get sad or you don't get happy. For anything you're a woman or you're a man so anyways the corned beef was off the chain it was just too much meat it was really good i will actually i would say it's too much meat i'm gonna eat the rest of this this whole half will go down tonight okay but those fries were off the chain too so anyways guys thank you so much for watching this video remember together we stand united we stand divided we fall we will unite you make a difference. I need to make a difference. And we're going to move on from there. We're going to move on from there. Pray for our leaders. Pray for our leaders. Good and the bad and the ugly. Because we must pray also for our enemies. And change starts with you. So guys, don't forget, if you want a shout out, hit up your girl comment section. I upload every week, four times a week. I upload Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. So stay tuned for that 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. And uh, I got you. If you hit up the comments right away, I will give you a shout out. If you have a channel, it helps your channel as well. But guys, I have been getting um, informed and I've seen this on other YouTube channels too, how they are delaying the notifications. Why? I have no idea. You know, and I've asked a couple of you who had complained about it to me. It was like, I'm not getting my notifications in time. You guys are coming to the channel looking for the video because you know when I upload, but YouTube is not pushing the notifications out like they should. So with that, I had contacted YouTube and I had screenshotted them. So they're working on figuring out what's going on. I think that's like not cool. You work hard on your channel, not just me, but other YouTubers. And they should be sending people notifications out ASAP. And all of you guys who complain, about it have your bell on all you know uh, one person hers was on personalized but for the most part all of you guys had it on all and she did too so she don't know how it changed but they are working on it 
but anyway still if you know that i upload on a certain day if i don't notify you on the community post still come over and check out our sister check us sister out so i thank you guys and i am working on it and i'm not knowing what's going on with youtube but anyways my first shout out goes to deborah cooper hello miss deborah love you hey beautiful joni meeks in the building what's up joni we also have the lovely a new break asmr check them out we have the lovely consuela cohen hey suela i also need to shout out um my sister miss tracy ann jackson we have miss sunshine goddess uniqueness tv Sassy Sonia Jones in the building. Also, my lovely fam, Explore with the Wagners. Of course, the beautiful Ms. B in the building. And of course, I have to shout out Stacy Wilson, my girl Stacy, and Miss. I, that's I was looking. Miss Sharon Donnell, Christopher's mom. Chris's mom. <laughs> Um, shout out to you. We love you. We love, love, love you. Um, but thank you to everyone who watched my video. Thank you so much. And to those of you who watch, but don't comment, I love you too. And don't forget guys, united we stand, divided we fall. You make the difference. Don't wait on someone else to make the difference. You make the difference with your vote, with your voice. Fight for what's right. We thank God for the protesters. So don't forget to stay safe. Stay blessed. Check on someone, let them know you love them. Yes, it's hard. Might be some snotty nose rascals, but let them know you love them. I love you, but God loves you more. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.